and here we are in the middle of uh, emptiness, uh, middle of uh, the desert on, on the northern Kenya. And as we are hitting the road towards uh, the Muyale, is a border, strategic border business hub, and also the border town, which linked uh, Kenya, northern Kenya to Ethiopia, and also northern Kenya to Somalia. <laughs> My name is Noor Ismail Nozol, diesel engineer, filmmaker, storyteller. Join me as I share my passion for building trucks and traveling to the remotest part of northeastern Kenya. bell to make sure that you catch up our weekly series of videos and totally utterly solitary in the desert so amazing such place can take uh, your soul and leave you time to breathe and you can really 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 take a deep breath and refresh your memory and those are the benefits of traveling in the African bush and enjoy that solitude and peace in the emptiness of the say quest for reacquaintance quest for searching the air for the emptiness the most remotest part uh, of this planet the thing we are achieving it successfully is what we have been looking for we are not complaining it was really worth to come here and we regret nothing we regret nothing we got what we got well, it is what it is this morning 7 and 7 morning cruise morning ride Epic adventure, extended drive across the African bush, African desert, African travelers. Well. It's an amazing place. Yeah. And those are the houses of um, um, of the local villages. Yeah, those are the pastoralists. They still maintain their culture. Uh, we had yesterday. I think it was, it was the right spot. Uh, there that uh, those people they have their culture. And once the one of the uh, family members passed away. Uh, for them, they can't resist to sit, uh, to be that, to be there anymore. The only thing they have to do after burial, finish the burial, they have to continue with the, the daily struggle for living. Migrate. Migrate. Now they're living now, the meaning they are struggle for living because they don't want to die. So they struggle for life. So they thought to their, according to their ideology, theory given by their assessor that if you keep staying there you will die so the more you keep moving you keep securing your life so fight for death and life moving in the desert leave everything behind and I've heard another thing those kind of uh, kind of house so called house it is self-contained so when I mean by self-contained you take a bath in only what you can take out is your stomach but the hygienic <laughs> self-contained but now maybe one time one day we we'll love we will we'll love to go on a pay visit inside the self-contained room of Gabra 
Hey, no, enjoy, why not? Enjoy that uh, self contain and then give it stars, maybe five stars, six stars, three stars, one star. We have no idea. But I think that's it. Uh, as we still enjoy the smooth morning drive, it's really great and fantastic morning. Let's keep, keep watching, keep subscribing. Be with us as we continue the same road, the same spirit of hitting the road and traveling. And the motive always is there, traveling in all the destination. Just motive which propel the whole trip is traveling and not the destination. But we have the intention of reaching the finishing line. It is what it is. And here we go, you can see the lowland down there. And so clearly we are still in the desert of north northeastern Kenya have a spectacular view amazing view epic scenery like never seen before and I'm very sure no one ever illustrates give you the flavor of watching the overland travel show as we do because we give you full package you watch with a special uh, cut edge technology of the cameras mostly mostly use on such kind of travel show and overland it's amazing so you have the full view as we are watching here you are seeing what we're seeing that's a good part of NN group Uganda gives you the sense of traveling from your living room from your bedroom wherever you are whatever time you are USA Europe Africa Asia, wherever you are, this is Africa, traveling African bush. This is it, yeah. Yeah, man. Full package. Bathroom and click there. See the bird of the flying, the fed on top of the Sabara and the desert of the northern, northern Kenya. Wow, what a day, what a trip, what amazing. Love it. It is what it is. Enjoy the cool music of the savannah in the desert. Wow. It is what it is. As we are hitting the road towards uh, the Muyale, it's a border, strategic border business hub, and also the border town which links uh, Kenya, northern Kenya to Ethiopia and also northern Kenya to Somalia. And fantastic. Right now, we just find out the I think this must be a jackal, a jackal, jackal, and we find the eagle. I think it's also the American eagle, I have no idea, but we find them uh, getting their. Uh, they are yum yum, they are breakfast. Let's say this can be, must be the jackal. No, it can't be hyena, eh? This can be jackal. Yeah. But those are the, those are the, the we, we got right now here, as you can see, with our other camera, it was uh, the uh, eagles. We got the eagles, and really fantastic, uh, being a desert. Really fantastic. Uh, look at the scenery, amazing. The cool breeze in the desert, really amazing. Uh, really amazing. Uh, here we are, as you can see, uh, we really, really enjoy the stay in the desert. Northern Kenya, epic scenery. Uh, 
Yeah, I think that's it for today, for, for now. As you see, hitting the road towards the north uh, of Kenya. I think they will be able to update you for more, uh, with more information. And uh, stick with us as we can continue. Thanks. All right, here we go. This is, uh, I think those are the, uh, this is a Jacko. Those ones, those birds are American Eagle, I think so. So, roadkill today, you become the breakfast and lunch supper. Good luck. In the middle of the road, this is the American Eagle, I think. Eh? I think Desert Eagle, Desert Eagle, is it? See, see, not that big, really huge. He's not chasing happy us to breakfast. go. Hey, yeah, happy breakfast and lunch. That's good I've made those those eagles with the far sight. So they saw this thing from far. The road kill. Desert fruit, which is what's the name of it? You know the name? Desert fruit breakfast. bell to make sure that you catch up our weekly series of videos.